a tech company from Finland started working on a messaging app in the distant 2009. A year later, the An Ordinary Instant Messaging app was officially presented on Symbian and Java. Jongla barely had the time to take a full breath as it got temporarily shut down. The product wasn't revived until 2012. This time around, creators positioned it as a fast, secure messaging app with some interactive elements. Interestingly, Jongla has won a number of prestigious awards, including Finland's Best App and Windows Apps 2014. The company's top management is currently eyeing the Asian market, namely Indonesia and Nepal. Well, taking into account such courageous attempts and the app's success, an interesting question comes to mind. What makes Jongla such a good messaging app? First of all, creators expanded the list of supported platforms, which now includes iOS, Android, Windows Phone, and even Firefox. Jongla automatically synchronizes your contact list, giving you the opportunity to send out an SMS invite to friends who haven't installed the app yet. The SMS will be sent via the app's interface. After all, the app's key goal is to replace the SMS. Jongla allows users to create voice messages and edit them to a certain extent by applying sound effects. The sound candy feature gives users access to three sound filters. They were designed to brighten up those answering machine sounding messages we always leave. Jongla will make it possible to attach photos and videos to messages and upload other media from the device's gallery. The texting app did not introduce any groundbreaking functions when it gave users the opportunity to share location tags and links with their buddies. Nevertheless, this definitely won't hurt the app and will help improve communication. The application from Finland offers a selection of stickers. There are oodles of them here and they are all vivid and one of a kind. For the sake of the truth, Jongla was one of the pioneers of animated stickers. The default number of available sticker packs is 4, but there are other commercial options you can pursue. The app is free by the way if you want to try it out and it won't depress you with ads. Jongla Channels is all about official promo chats. Viber has also implemented this feature but on a far larger scale. It grants assistance in liaising between the company and public figures and brands, thus creating monetization opportunities. The communication client is very light in terms of how much of your phone memory it takes up, so just to be on the safe side, you should always have it close by. Looking at the flip side, what can the seemingly modern and relevant product improve on? There are no voice or video calls. I want to say that it doesn't matter, but the standards have changed and this is no longer acceptable. Jongla does not let users preview links and as a result, any link will be a pig in a poke for the other chat participant. Not extreme, but still criticism. Safety is by no means Jongla's strong suit. The TSL encryption protocol that the European product uses just can't guarantee a proper and modern level of personal data protection. That is it. Thanks for watching. Communicate in real life. Communicate online. And see you soon.